How goes it everybody? My name is Howitzer and welcome back to SnowRunner. Today I have this one. The Z2ZE86 Vendival. I, at least I think that's how you say that name anyway. ZXP990 brings us this one. And from the couple pictures that I did see of this, I think it's he went towards like a rally car kind of? I, I don't really know. But I have tried... Uh, numerous mods from him and they're all actually pretty good so i'm wondering if this is going to be just as good I, I, I have no idea let's see what we can do to this thing all right for engines we got some engines here obviously i'll i'm gonna go with the uh the z2 engine because well it just makes it more fun gearbox got stock fine-tuned freeway and snow runner i uh, will do snow runner i guess Suspension. Well, it does have a little lift kit for it. You got two different raised ones. Seems like the second option gives it just a little bit higher. And of course, you got the stock. So we'll get her up off the ground a little bit. <laughs> Tires. See, I, I think I might have made this mistake on one of his mods before. He has the Z2 tires uh, right away, even though they're in like the, the highway class. So we're going to go with the 31 inch Z2s because they're probably they're probably the best one out of the bunch, I would I would imagine. I like the rims too. The rims look really nice. Winch. We got the stock extended advanced autonomous high power. Uh, the winch 20 and the winch 40. We'll do the winch 40. Sometimes that length is needed. Snorkel. Looks like you just got the tall mushroom. Sure. I don't. I guess we'll find out how it does through the water. I don't really know. Uh, rear bumper. You can put a trailer hitch on if you want. Will this thing pull a trailer? <laughs> oh, we might have to try that. I'll put it on. Rally equipment. Okay, yeah, he did kind of go for a rally car. You got the uh, the fender flares. We'll do that. Spare wheel. Ah, eh, why not? You got the little uh, side light there. Yeah, why not? We'll we'll deck it out like it's a like it's a rally car. You got a front window sticker. Ah, we don't need that. Front bumper. You got the standard or the safari. Safari rally bumper, huh? Sure. In car equipment. Looks like you got you can carry some fuel, some repair parts. Couple tires or water. You can carry water with it too. Interesting. It looks like the fuel weighs it down just a little bit, but the repair parts don't. I'll take the repair parts just in case I need them. Miscellaneous, you got a rear spoiler or a second rear spoiler. We'll go with the bigger one. And, uh, and you can take the stickers off the side if you really want to. Wait. I guess you can add weight to it. Really? That's interesting. Might have to screw around with that. I think for now, though, I think maybe I'll just leave it alone because I don't. Yeah, I'll leave it alone for now. Exhaust, you got the stock or the slant cut. Sure. Colors. Oh, you got. Yeah, OK. Yeah, it looks like a fucking rally car. But of course, you can choose different colors if you want to. I guess we'll go with the rally car look. I got to get rid of that sticker, though. And you can do bobbleheads and other accessories if you want to. Uh, let's go see how this does. Uh, I honestly have no idea. It looks like it's a little bit off the ground. Maybe it'll do all right. I don't know. Let's go find out. Oh, look at this little guy. <laughs> Look at the inside ones. Right hand drive. Doesn't look actually, doesn't look all that bad in here. Ooh. Oh yeah. Seems like this thing makes some pretty decent power. 
And it will pull your scout trailers. That is absolutely hilarious. Yeah, we're definitely going to have to do that later. Let's go see how it does on its own. Diflock is on all the time. That's... That's nice to see. Not too often you get somebody making... Oh, boy. This thing is... Wow, see, goodness gracious. Maybe I should have put some... Oh! Maybe I should have put some weight in this thing, huh? Come on, roll all the way over. Uh, we'll put it in four-wheel drive right away. Take her through that little mud pit here. Whoops, I didn't put it in four-wheel drive, sorry. Thought I did. Yes, I did. Yeah. Actually went through that really well. This thing does ride a little weird. I guess I do have to put some weight in it, don't I? We'll take her through Swampy Town. Well, we're riding fourth gear. It seemed to be a little too much for it. A little too much wheel speed there. Goodness, this thing is going through here actually really good for a car. Get into some of this deeper water. She slows down just a little bit, but a lot of them do that. Oh, get into some really deep water. I don't think that snorkel's quite high enough. Going over the down trees, fairly decent. This thing really doesn't care, does it? Actually going through here pretty quick. All right, here comes the deep spot. I wonder if it's going to be too deep for it. Oh, please don't. Okay. We're just above. <laughs> just below the snorkel, I should say. Hell yeah. This thing actually... It's actually doing really good. Surprisingly. But of course I do have all the all the OP options on too. Keep that in mind. You could probably have this thing perform well, any way yet I suppose you'd really want it to. It does have a lot of choices, which is kinda nice. Yeah, but definitely some weight is definite is in order. Because it's a little bouncier than than normal it's it's actually kind of weird but I it went through that really well surprisingly let's go do some other stuff yeah let's take her down here once let's see how it does <laughs> some rock climbing if it oh if it'll even do it we ain't got much for suspension travel. Oh. Oh, I'm. I'm kind of stuck here. Help me. Help me. Oh. Well, I mean, at least, like, being like a light little car, it's nice and easy to flip over. That's a plus. Let's see if we can get it up here. Let's see if it'll actually... No way. <laughs> Is it really? Oh, am I hung up? Ooh. Come on. Come on. There you go. That's impressive. This thing isn't all that high off the ground. I don't know if it's going to do this. But we're going to fucking try anyway. Oh my god, really? I don't think I have the ground clearance, though. Oh boy. God, it walked right up. Like nothing, but... 
oh, I just don't have the a big a big enough tire or tall enough ground clearance for this. Oh. I don't think it's gonna do this. Let's go put that uh the highway transmission and see if we can get some speed out of it once. Alright. Am I gonna be able to get the the speed oh I want out of it and am I gonna be able to control it I did put a little bit of weight on maybe it wasn't enough I don't think I'm gonna get the speed oh I wasn't in six gear <laughs> oh I took that tree out <laughs> well I would say under the right circumstances this might be a jumper I didn't get into six gear but it didn't do that all that bad. Let's do a little more off-road stuff with it once. Well, it'll tow a trailer. So let's bring a trailer with us, too. I have no idea how this is going to do, but... We'll see if she'll do it. Maybe the trailer will maybe keep it a little more stable, you know? Oh, yeah. You can also do this. You can put the headlights up, too. <laughs> it's a cool little feature. I'll take her down the little trail here. Well, we already know the tires are, are pretty decent. So I do believe that it's going to go up the hill pretty good. Oh, yeah. Yeah, right up the hill. Not much of a, a problem. It is still a little bouncy. I didn't want to put too much weight on it, though, because then you lose your ground clearance, and I didn't want to sacrifice that. Not too many cars in the old modding community here that, that'll pull a trailer like this. Oh my god. I did a fucking front flip. That was awesome. <laughs> Holy shit. Alright, let's continue on our way here. Oh god. Oh. Yeah, I think maybe... Oof. Maybe a little more... Suspension height? Wouldn't hurt. Maybe just a little bigger of a tire probably wouldn't hurt either. I mean, how often do you see a 31-inch tire on a car, though, I guess? But, dude, this is a badass little fucking car, man. This would be actually a pretty decent Scout. It sure does seem like it would probably go anywhere you really want it to. It is. It, it's fairly decent on the rocks. But you can't really take it there because it just doesn't have, you know, a, a big enough tire and ground clearance and stuff. But it will do rocks if you want it to. Oh, don't. Oh. Come on, keep going. Keep going. Yeah. No, no, no. Stop, stop, stop. Alright, we're gonna see if she'll do the little hill here. It's a little hill, but it sure is steep. Oh, man. Oh. Right up the hill. Not a fucking care in the world. Wow. That was awesome. Alright, let's go back down. We'll send her on down the hill here. Oh boy. Oh god. Oh, camera. Come on, get on the wheels there. Yeah. Yeah. 
We haven't even broke anything yet. Surprisingly. Let's keep going. And this little bastard's pretty fun. Very interesting he would go this route. To make a car that would put a quite a few trucks to shame, I'll tell you that. This little bastard puts a lot of trucks to shame, actually. But, like I said earlier, I do have all the OP options on, too. So this thing probably will do whatever the hell you want it to do. Alright, here comes the puddle. Oh, it held on the sixth gear through the puddle. Damn. Fucking A. Hell yeah. Not bad. This thing did really well. I've seen all I need to see. Well, that was the Z2ZE86 Vendaval, if that's how you say that last word there. This thing is actually really cool. This thing's badass. It was actually a lot of fun. It doesn't look bad either. It looks like a... Like a car from like Gran Turismo back in the day or something. <laughs> Maybe not jacked up like this, but definitely the paint scheme and the, the stickers and everything. God, this thing performed really well. But that's the options I chose. Maybe you don't want it to be so OP. You know, that's, that's your opinion. I like having fun. Yeah, this thing was good. Makes a fuck ton of power. God, I just can't believe what this thing actually did. It was really good. Good job with this one. I didn't mind it. I had a lot of fun. So if you enjoyed this video, give it a like. Hit that subscribe button for me as well. And I will hopefully see you in the next one.